Good morning. Hi, um, Mums World. Mums are busy, mums are incredible, mums inspire us in every way. We created Mums World basically to serve and to focus on the mums' needs or parents' needs and their children in the Middle East. You're probably aware that in the Middle East today there's a lot of things happening. Women can drive in Saudi. We've just had the biggest um, collection of uh, leaders around the world trying to promote the changes in Saudi Arabia. All that is impacting us. The whole um, ecosystem is changing. The consumers are more aware. Uh, all the support system and governments are being more uh, supportive for growth and creating jobs and supporting all the new industries like e-commerce. The, this category is very strong in the region, $8 billion and 10 million births a year. We're still on a very, very high birth rate compared to the rest of the world. Mothers in the Middle East f uh, have the same challenges as mothers all over the world, but it's compounded because there is a very limited choice because not all the brands and all the uh, categories available globally are available in the region, and that's because the region is very fragmented. And there are, uh, Saudi Arabia is probably the 13th biggest country in the world in terms of size, but with a, a smaller road network, not as many uh, public transport. So actually getting the items to the consumer, they have over 60 cities in Saudi, is very difficult. Um, difficult to access, the products are very expensive, and just doing your shopping, although Dubai seems like the shopping haven, actually 70% of all the retail space is apparel and giving people essentials is very, very limited. So this is how uh, our consumer feels at the moment. 66% of moms in the region are online researching products. So we, we have a captive community. 82% of moms need the convenience and the choice. And 50% of moms don't relate to brands. And that's compounded because actually brands go to market in English, but there's very few brands that go to market in Arabic, and that's the predominant language in the region. Mums World is bilingual in Arabic and English. We're, we have a mobile app, we have a mobile site, and we're very, very strong in social media, which is actually very, very highly consumed. So YouTube, Instagram, and Snapchat are super highly consumed in the region compared to the rest of the world. So this is how our solution looks like. We have 120,000 products on our site, 1,500 brands, really a very, very large choice by global standard. Convenience, we deliver to moms within two to three days, and we basically guarantee the quality and the price of our products. And our community, really the community is the cornerstone of our growth. We double in size year on year, and this is basically because our community of a million moms believe in us and they come to us as the vertical that's going to provide the information and the support system and the reviews for them to make that decision. And we take the mom from the minute she's pregnant to through to when her children are 12 years old. We've really established a great brand in the region and people do say, if you can't find it, go to Mums World. We've got over 50 awards in the last few years and everybody from Time Out to Forbes has recognized Mums World as a leading brand in the region. So we're at $155 basket size, 200 in our um, expansion market of Saudi Arabia. We're 34% uh, margin, which is quite high for a marketplace. We do not stock all our products. A lot of our products are on back to back from the suppliers, so we don't have a very big inventory. And um, we basically check every product for quality. Mums are here for convenience and to feel secure. And we were going to make sure that that end-to-end -end experience is perfect. 40% uh, plus of our consumers come back and buy three to four times. And on average, every basket has over four items. So really, when we have that consumer captive, we can re generate the marketing costs very, very quickly. We are the largest community online, and we've been able to uh, harness the power of the, the bloggers and the vloggers, and a lot of them actually have voluntarily come to Mums World to review products, create their own pages on Mums World, where they actually um, document their own experience with products and review them. And a lot of them, some of these um, vloggers are 200,000 followers each and they command the power of the inf you know, and influence of these moms, both in Arabic and English. 
And this is just some of the examples of how the community organically generates traffic and sales for Mumswell. We also have a very active blog, which we use just the power of the community and the power of all the bodies that mothers trust, like the doctors and the clinics and schools, to create content that moms find relevant. And that's a very scalable way to grow without having to invest heavily in content, which is a key pillar to uh, Moms World today. This is how our loyalty looks like. You know, the customer lifetime value is super important to us. We want her to come back again and again, and we want her to be with us from the minute she's pregnant to the time when her children are 12 years old. We're growing rapidly, and at the moment we're on a growth projection tile. We double in size every year, and as we enter Saudi today, 30% of our sales are in Saudi Arabia, but we plan to see that going up to north of 50%, and that's where our um, biggest baskets are of $200. We're in Qatar, Bahrain, Kuwait, which is really the GCC, and we're looking to expand into the Levant. We deliver to 22 countries, but we are going to start marketing across the Middle East, so the other countries where we haven't invested any marketing do uh, dollar today, but we still have customers in these regions. Please come and see me if you have any questions after.